just like old times. Back on the road. We are, uh, I'm just gonna, yeah. Is it gonna work with the glare? I don't know. I don't know. I can't actually see if that's showing anything. But we're out here. Going over, what, what's, what's this bridge called? Seven Bridge, baby. Thank you. I don't know if it's the new one or the old one. Yeah, that's old why one. I was asking because I wasn't sure if it was like ah, if I, they have different names for the different bridges or they're both just called Seven Bridge. But like, oh yeah, same. just the new and the old. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, okay. it, this is the old. But we are en route to New Wave, <whistles> taking on Act Two this evening, and that is the that is the white noise of victory. Mm. <laughs> As we go take on uh, Benjamin Hall and Jack Nutson of Act Two, New Wave Nine before they get to New Wave, New Wave DX for some, have you seen the promo pictures for that? They just have the big, the big spray painted X. Oh, nice. Yeah. Triple H, Paul Levesque. Bringing in some of the old WWE fellas. Going to do a reunion nice. in Wales. Yeah. Can you imagine? Yeah, I think, I think Brandon yeah. can pull, I think Brandon can pull some strings. If anyone can. Anyway, we're looking forward to, uh, looking forward to having a, having a first time ever match with Act 2. And we're running a little class beforehand with a couple of the new wave students that would be fun too. And as it's kind of a, a busy weekend for us, that is. which you will see in this video, because <laughs> <laughs> um, then we're going up to Leicester. Is it Leicester or no? No, I was right the first time. I was it's right Leicester, the first time. Yeah, yeah. Leicester. Leicester for a wrestling resurgence. It's a damn Moneywood blood. It's goddamn Moneywood. Blood is a horrible color for a wrestling hair. Worst, worst thing you can do to your hair is bleach it blonde. Yeah. We'd never. I we we plural. I could never respect someone to do that. And then from Leicester, we're actually, then we go back to, um, then we head back to Headbutt Studios for the night. And then, Sunday we go to Southampton Forever Pro, take on CPF. That was just a three, that was CPF. CPF Elite. Yeah, that's, that's why. <laughs> Not CPF Gold. Uh, so Danny Black, Joe Lando, we're one and zero over you boys. So we're looking forward to going uh, and staying undefeated, even though the Southampton curse is still alive. The Southampton curse does have a Rev Pro curse at the minute too. No, to be fair, yeah, the, yeah. the Southampton curse has leaked out into the rest of Rev Pro. Now Numbers we're just yeah, on their now, side. now we're just completely cursed in general. Cursed, the curse of victory. But we're trying our best. The curse of defeat. And that's the main thing. That's the main thing. That Fuck. and everyone having fun. The only thing left to say. <laughs> Roll the B-roll. <laughs> no, now you say your bit. Roll the B-roll? Oh, what were you going to oh. say before? Oh, uh, wrestle the loser. Oh, yeah. yeah. I just like it as a way. Nice. Roll the B-roll. <laughs> ah, wrestle the loser. Ah, ah! Neck up there. In comes TK. Big tag in. Straight into the headlock. Oh, wait a minute. Mamma just tag in. Oh! Oh! Oh, wait a minute. Double spring. Oh! Oh! Oh, and jumping over. Oh! Wow! That was amazing! That took a lot of coordination. You have, to think, you have to think, at the start, Sunshine Machine must have really been underestimating Act 2, but if they're pulling stuff out like that, they're now taking them seriously. Oh, what a beautiful elbow drop! Oh, but wait a minute. Oh! Twisting the neck of TK Cooper. Oh, but they've still got the foot. Still keeping separation. TK Cooper trying to keep Jack Nudson away from the corner, but T oh, Jack Nudson booting TK away. TK gets the tag on Mambo. He's on the top. Oh! Oh, wait a minute, ducking that, ducking that closer. Oh, and a knee to the face. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, and a big. 
big, big cut of there. Turns around. Oh! Goes for a super kick. Oh! oh double super kick! Oh, wait a minute. Are they looking for another double super kick? They're going for the double super kick on TK. Oh! Well, wait a minute. Still TK on still on his feet. They must have forgotten that he's a Samoan. Oh, he's flying up. Mambo nipping up. Oh, my God. Double headbutts. That's just straight rock them. Oh, oh my goodness me! An assisted so and so drop. Oh, and a big kick out! Oh my god! Oh wait. Oh. Falling backwards. Going for it again. Real barrel. Wait a minute. Oh, oh. victory roll pin! One, two, oh, oh. my god! Super oh, kick! Super kick! Back off the ropes! Oh, oh. my god! Was it going for a close on What's this? Oh! Sunset flip power bomb. Oh. TK. TK is tagged in. Oh, oh my god! On the back of the net, he's driven into the mat. And that, that is, it. is it. Wow! Absolutely incredible! It's good to see you paying your dues, Brennan. I know, yeah. <laughs> Rightfully so. For the old boys, yeah. You need from the same age. Yeah, you don't want to forget the you don't want to forget the kick pad, huh, Brennan? Huh? You don't want to forget the kick pad. No, no, no. No, no, of course not. Yeah. Expert. Yeah, there you go. Let's get that on there. Boom. Nice. Definitely oh. take this Watch this. How's it going, Dan? You suck in, but. Oh, it's a good job there. Oh, look at the suck. You filming that suck, man? <laughs> I'm filming that <laughs> yeah, suck, yeah, you know? Yeah, that's the one. Thank you, mate. Nice. Don't take it off again, though, Dan. Don't, don't no, you, I don't you dare it take it off now. again. <laughs> don't do it. I won't do it. <laughs> whoa, <myself>. whoa. <laughs> well, <laughs> stayed over in old Mamba's hometown of Nuki last night. Pretty fun times. So gonna take uh, TK down for a walk around the beaches. Other such parts, you know, uh, uh, well, there's sort of uh, bars and beaches. A beautiful, beautiful Nikki. Maybe see the cliffs. Doesn't look, doesn't look very beachy out there. Ah, no, just over the hill, just over yonder is where I fell in love with the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> Knows. <laughs> Cut to that clip from that ECM from years ago. Ah, Stampede, Stampede, we're gonna go! Lester, like our good close and personal friend Bray Wyatt says, we're here. We're here. <laughs> yeah. We had to take on the money with blondes, thanks to another uh, great job from Mambo and Google Maps. They did good, man. Yeah, I gave them the full smile. I never give them before. Who uses the Google, the Google Maps rating system? <laughs> You know, if it's bad, I need to, I need to be better. Is it good? So, so now, that we're, now that we're here um, in the British territories, Mambo, what, yeah. what, what can the... I mean, obviously, this is retrospective. Oh, shoot, I'm stuck. <laughs>
Let's hottest new segment. 30 seconds to guess your favorite animal. I am here with flying Mike Bird, British wrestling legend and extraordinaire. Mike Bird, the clock is about to be on. Have you got your animal in your mind? Yep. All right then. Okay, here we go. Clock it, Uh Can your favorite animal uh, fly? Is it avian? Yep. Does it lay eggs? Is it feathered? Yep. Does it have a beak? Yep. Does it have like weird feet that get along? Does it collect worms? Yeah. Does it shit seeds? Yeah. Yeah. I'm stumped. I have no idea. Okay, cool. Dragon? Dragon. It's dragon. It's dragon. It's dragon. 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 How long have we got left? How long have we got left? Oh, you're 48 seconds in. Wow, we're this close. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. So it's your last match, Chris. Cut, cut a shoot promo on what happened. So I, uh, I took, I took a, a shoulder tackle. And, uh, the doctor said, that's it. If I take one more shoulder tackle like that, that's it. And that's why you had to drop the Art House Championship. That's why I had to drop the Art House Championship on the flight. Because you were booked to win. Yeah. But you, you, I was booked to win, but obviously the shoulder tackle. You wanted to put the young guy. Exactly. Pull it. <laughs> why are you laughing, TK Cooper? <laughs> And now you're having a Hazy Jane to Hazy Jane for the last one. hang up the, so the gauntlets. The proverbial cuddly shoes. Yeah, look, they're, they're left in the ring, that's why he's not wearing them. I left them in the ring, that's why he's not wearing them. They're out there, gathering fans, gathering fans. Look how many hooks we have out there. Oh, 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 oh. That's it, roll the beer off. Oh, no, you go. <laughs> There it is. 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 <laughs> is it right here? No, it's not it. Oh, it is. This is. This is the. Anyway, so uh, the, here we are in Jolly Old Southampton. Mambo's just, Mambo's just been rinsed, ATP to go over some random bridge we've never been over in yeah, Southampton. Right, Eagle cucked me. Couldn't even see the scene. In the back we've got the man we're going to uh, beat this afternoon hey, uh, at the 1860. Well, I was honestly going to forget what the hell was. But, Danny, what, says it right there, mate. Danny, what move do you want to lose to today? Um, Comment below what move you think you should lose to. I think uh, double spiral tap. Double spiral yeah. tap. That so there's one person doing a double spin, or me and Mambo both doing it. Do you like the Cody Rhodes thing? thing always do. Oh, okay. And um, well, if you're winning, what do you want to beat Mambo with? A double spiral tap. Oh, cool. So it I, goes it goes both ways. Yeah, I can't do one though. That's okay. Just Don't worry, me neither. That's cool. Um, yeah, that's this bit of the of the vlog done. Nice. Thanks Very everyone. Valuable head. Danny, say roll the B-roll. Roll the B-roll. Former British Tag Team Champions making their way to the ring. Everyone knows sunshine! Oh, the opposing corners who tried to fight back. Spinning kick, face buster. Mambo coming to the wow, to the breaks away the legs from the outside. Listen, all I'm going to say, listen, all I'm going to say about Sunshine Machine, Chuck Mambo and TK Cooper, look, I know they started up their escaping the mid-card YouTube show again, and I know that they've uh, they've not uh, tagged Revolution Pro Wrestling, they tag everywhere else, but not Revolution Pro Wrestling, because they don't want to stooge themselves off, but what I'll say is, Sunshine Machine need to take things seriously, a bit of aggression. I'd argue it's necessary. Oh, look at that exploder suplex! Yeah, look at the way TK Cooper closes up so quickly. Often you'd see him, in times like that, he'd hit that exploder, he'd look towards the crowd. Ball breaker, Mambo looking to follow up with a super kick. Lando Cat caught it, but Mambo, I think he was using it as a feint because he connected low. He's straight back to the hamstring. And the tactic was it, uh, the Callum Newman match, we saw Connor Mills target the legs of uh, Callum Newman, didn't we? Is Chuck Mambo doing the same here to Joe Lando? Absolutely trying to take out 
where the majority of the offense is based from. And what I learned about Joe Lando as well, Joe, he's put on quite a bit of size on his frame since we last saw him. That's great because it shows he's taking his professional wrestling seriously. When you're at a cruiserweight, you have to do it gradually because you want to be able to retain that speed, don't you? Elbow up. Mambo tags in. Mambo's legal. I don't think CPF realize it. Double gut buster. Yeah, okay, come on. Come on, Joe Lando's oh, oh no, he got caught by Mambo. Headbutt from T. All team maneuvers to get the job done has cost them. Because Joe Lando, not 100%, and he pays. Assisted wheelbarrow suplex. That's a two and a half, and that move has a name as well. Go on, name it. Oh wow. Hits it again. But you can see every time. He's having to go back to hold on to that knee. Danny Black just pushed his fan down harm's way and connected with a Spanish fly. But watch out, here comes Mambo with a reef breaker, which just wiped him out. German suplex with a release from Joe Lando, the fighting headbutt. Rocked. Lando turned inside out. Oh my god, that's a headshot! Yeah! Shooting star to the back, my god! He hasn't seen Mambo! Oh, he hasn't seen Mambo! And that was straight across the leg! Straight across the leg! Much damage has been done to that leg. And they got all of that one, Captain Midnight Revenge. And Sunshine Machine got them, Gio. But my God, were they made to work for that? Yeah. That was a, a new edge to Sunshine Machine. Something yeah. we've seen. It was, but listen, that's what is a mark of a good team, a good professional wrestler. When things aren't working, you go back to a drawing board, you change things up, you change up strategies. And most importantly, Gio, you don't give up. What is happening, wrestling fans? I am Chuck Mamba. I am a sunshine machine. And this Saturday, I am on my own, one-on-one -on -one for the Attack Pro Wrestling Championship against Wild Boar Mike Hitchman, a man who embodies just about everything I love about professional wrestling, a man who I have stood in contains and watched take on the world and kill it every single time. Pretty long odds, pretty long odds of a tag team specialist who has been away for a little while, coming in and dethroning one of the most dominant champions there has ever been, and an attack original at that. I have been away for a little while. I can't say that I've shaped what attack is in the current day, but I can tell you, I can promise you, that everything that stands before you has been shaped by attack. Everywhere I've been, attack has been in my bones. Every I have been in the mat, the ropes I have bounced on might as well have an attack footprint in them. When I come on Saturday, I'm fighting for a chance to take that title and to pay forward what people at attack, the likes of Wild Boar, have done for me. A chance to shape the future. Now, isn't this weird and wonderful world of ours all about the long odds?
she saw she never made another one. Oh, he looks so sad. to be working with people that have that buzz. Fish in the sea, you know how I feel. It's just one of those things that it doesn't necessarily weigh on the minds of us. It doesn't keep us up at night, but it's one of those things that kept us motivated, kept, kept the chip on our shoulder. And it's the mm -hmm. fact that maybe our journey was a little bit longer than others. When I think to myself, are we the new kings of wrestling? Is that what Sunshine Machine are in this, in this day and age, in this modern era? And if we're not, and if we're not, if you dispute that, why don't you come find us in an electric ballroom? We get to prove why we're the best tag team in the world. This is gonna be day one in defining our legacy. We're here to prove a point. We ain't no underdogs. We're the Desi Boys, and we're bringing a butter chicken beat down. We are motivated by the love of the citizens of Sunshine Machine Country. I want to dance, I want to party at the show, I want the people to be dancing, but when that bell rings... We are the best tag team this aisle has seen in a very long time. The top of every mountain is the bottom of the neck, and I hope fans have their hiking booties on, because we got mountains to climb, we got places to go. 
We step across the ring from us. We're going to prove why we're the best tag team in the world. We will leave you looking like fools. We have a chip on your shoulder. Now's our time. Because everybody knows. Hey, thanks so much for watching this video, and if you enjoyed it and want to keep supporting Sunshine Machine, make sure to go and follow us on Insta and Twitter, at Chuck Mambo and at PureTKC to keep up with where we're wrestling next. And why not go to sunshinemachinerules.bigcartel.com and pick yourself up some Sunshine Machine merch. Helps keep the lights on here at Headbutt Studios, and it keeps the Mambo Mobile in good nick to get us to that next show. Thanks so much. Get in the wall.